everybody, what's up? Quincy here, and welcome back to Slime Rancher 2. It's, uh, I've been having a lot of fun with this game, just kind of on the side. And you guys seem to be enjoying it too, so we're gonna keep going. Ah, look at all those sweet, sweet plorts. Yeah, you guys eat all that food. I'm gonna throw some more carrots in their bin. Is this a food thing? Is this for food? I'm not sure. I think that's for food. Yes. Shoot the food in here. There will be more food for you guys later. And I will collect the plorts. We're, ma we're doing good on plorts. I think what I'm trying to do is actually drive the price a little bit since I have four kinds of plorts and potential to make more, actually. Um, I accidentally, um may have opened a way forward. So I think we're gonna try to check that out today. But, might as well, since we're here, take care of our babies, sell some plorts, make some money, and then go out on an adventure. Yeah, I'll, I'll chuck the babies, cause we don't need them. We just need, we just need some chickens. I'll make sure I leave a regular chicken or two in there, just so that these guys can have some food. Because man, they hunky. Look at them cats. I also think our firefly guy might like some of our excess fruit, cause I'm not gonna lie. I feel like we have a little too much food now. A little too much food. Whoops, that's the wrong button. <laughs> we have so much food, we are bursting at the seams, so I think we'll go and give the, uh... I'll see if I can't go to the, uh, lighthouse man. The, the firefly man, that's what I meant. Jesus. Oh, but first, we have some messages. Let's check out who's, who's sending us a message. Ah, Victor, and a new guy. Well, let's see what Victor has first. Beatrix, I've done it. I believe I've cracked the super mysterious code that was sent to me. It was uh, astoundingly complex. I believe that the AI that created this code displays a comparable intelligence to my own. So very advanced, almost alien? Are we dealing with intelligent slimes? That's terrifying, Victor, go on. Oh, you're probably wondering what it said? Well, I determined this mysterious, perhaps even alien AI sent a message that says, Hello. Not much, but pleasantries count for something. More importantly though, the moment I cracked it, I received another message. It's almost as though this mysterious AI is monitoring me. How exciting. I haven't decrypted it yet, but the code is considerably more complex. This should be fun. Well, back to work as ever. Thanks, Victor. Alright, who we got? We got Ogden Ortiz. Who is this gentleman? Hola, Beatrix. Are you there? It's me, Ogden Ortiz. I hear you're off on a big new adventure on a mysterious island filled with secrets and danger and maybe a few succulent fruits or veggies. The world never has... N the... the Sorry, I had the <laughs> I had the stroke. The world has never been seen before. Hold on, I am confused with my own words. <laughs> I hear you're off on a big new adventure on a mysterious island filled with secrets and danger, and maybe a few succulent fruits or veggies the world has never seen before. There we go. Now I got it. You know, I had to ask. Ever since you got me a steady supply of Kuka Doba fruits, I've been reaching for even greater culinary hats within the far, far range. Plus, I'm getting pretty tired of eating Kuka Doba pie, Kuka Doba souffle, Kuka Doba pudding, Kuka Doba corn corne, corn corne. I, oh, I'm sorry, Beatrix. I'm so I can't. I don't speak at the good. Kuka Doba con Kuka Doba. I'm running out of ideas and willpower. <laughs> So if you see something new, please tell me all about it. Tasty treats aside, I want to know all about the new flora and fauna you discover. Never forget, every bit of this wild world is precious and worth our care. And stay hydrated out there. All that adventuring will work up at sweat, so take this water tap. A portable water tap? Good luck, Beatrix. Keep me posted. I'm rooting for you. Alright, man. So we gotta... Alright. <laughs> I suppose that works. Off towards the lighthouse man. The light bug man! Why do I keep calling him a lighthouse? He is far from a house. He is simply a man that desires food. Are we there yet? 
Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? I think I went the wrong way. God damn it. Ah, there he is. We found our boy. All right, time for you to get fed a bunch of fruits as well. I think we have plenty. Ah, I didn't even use all of them. Wow. Here, guys, have some plort. Have some fruit. Eat. Give me your plorts. Ooh, and I'll take some roosters home. What there, Lapis? Uh, eat the fruit. <laughs> I want all of the plorts. Did I get the plorts? But there's no way. Come on. You guys want the fruit? Eat the fruit. Eat the fruit. I guess now we have this lovely cage to check out. Can I take some of this water now? No, I think I have to build something before I can do that. Damn it. What is this? It desires cat plort. Ooh, I got those at home. Maybe we go grab some and come back because I kind of kind of want to see what this mysterious door is all about. Why don't we go grab one real quick since we have so many at the house. And maybe we check out that fabricator too and see what it takes for us to get a, a water majigger. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Yep, I'm going deeper into the recesses of the world instead of actually going home to get cat plorts. <laughs> Silly me. Oh, can I not just... Okay. I'm gonna wait on the cat slime ones, but I will get a couple cat slime and phosphorus ones to send to our crafting area. Maybe some of these can go to the crafting area, too. I don't really know what we need, so maybe, maybe that's a place to start. Let's go checking and seeing what we need for the crafting of things. Because plorts are nice for money, but if we don't necessarily need money immediately and have some other things to spend some money on, then... Or, spend plorts on, rather, like some inventions in our mad scientist lair, then let's do that. I can get a tank booster. Uh, which sounds great. Let's do that. Now I can hold 30! Power! Power! A lot of housekeeping this episode. I kind of expected we'd be on an adventure already, but alas, stuff must get done for upgrades, yes. I want this, and I want this, but I oh, I need to get more. Okay, that's fine. Sorry guys, not a ton of food to go around. Why is that? Oh, this is the plort section. My bad! So many things to explore. The cave. Me not knowing where I'm going. All wonderful things. Oh, it's not marked on my map now. Well, let's see if I can remember how to get there. I know it's not far, right? This seems... Ah, right, uh, here we are. Maybe I can take back some of this food if we're not gonna eat it. Oh, there were slimes in there. I see, I see. Another water thing I can't do anything about. We're here looking for some new slimes. There's some material I can get here. Ooh, a strange diamond. Ooh, what does that do? What's my slime PDF? Very strange, but more valuable. Even in the dark, these diamonds seem to shine as if light is passing through them. Strange diamonds are highly valued for their use in a variety of warp tech processes, being almost impossibly dense and intricate in their composition. Strange diamond can reflect light within itself so profoundly that it actually bends time. Fascinating. Fascinating. Now I take it you need a cat for it. Aha! It only needed one, apparently. But we have opened the way. What do we have here? Another thing. Another pod we have found. What does this do? A tank liner. Ooh, vac tank guard. I wonder what that means. I'm sure we'll figure that out, though. Alright, we got some stuff to take back. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Now, I don't think I've seen any more big slimes. I think I've taken care of both of the big, thick slimes that I've seen so far. So, and I'm not really sure where to put this diamond. I'm guessing our crafty majigger is what needs it. I would believe. But, you know, I don't really know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure that out. All right, no more dilly-dallying. It's time for adventure. Uh, okay, that's just a straight cliff into nowhere. Uh, that is not the exit. Isn't there something I could buy over yonder that was... 
Nice. Helpful. I know I got some more spaces so we can get some more food going. But what was it? This over here? I can also... Uh, this dark, damp, mushroom-covered expansion to the conservatory is a refugee from the sun for slimes and ranchers alike. Why don't we purchase this and upgrade? Might as well. I'm interested. We could use some more space. We only have a couple more spaces for food and we can rearrange things as we need to, I suppose. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, we could make room for our cat slimes down here instead. I'm sure they'd be very happy. Maybe there's some food you can only grow in the dark. We have s we definitely needed the upgrade. And I wonder if this also just gives us a new area to explore. Because this feels very... Very wide. Oh, yeah! We did get a small little area out here. It's not very big, it doesn't seem, but... Hey, it's worth checking out and exploring, right? Maybe it's all cave. But I'm okay with that. Alright, I think the cave is good to go. Let us, uh... Let us move on <laughs> from cave to an adventure, like I promised. Okay, well, I was on my way to the new location and then all hell broke loose. I don't really know what happened, but I think I'm just gonna let it happen and uh, keep moving forward. Uh, yeah, yeah, let's go with that. I think that's probably, probably the safest option. Let's just, just let that keep going. I was in so over my head when I first started here. I remember hauling Jellystone back to the conservatory by hand because I was so excited, breathless and sweating. I was going about everything all wrong, but I was happy. There's little time now, so I'll need these refinery links if I'm going to be efficient. This time, I'm going to do it right. Indeed, indeed you are. Ah, there it is. I think this was it. I think it was this big shiny portal that appeared. Will this take me to lands far, far away? We shall certainly see. I'm gonna suck with these chickens though, because I can always use more food for the cats. We have gone through the portal to lands anew. It's called the Amber Valley. Oh my. I wonder if we'll find some boom boom slimes. That would be nice. And some rock slimes, some rock boom booms. Yeah. Rocky boom booms. Hey, okay, I'm like the present to explore and see if I can't find where to get a map from, right? I guess I just go down. Wee! I'm hoping we find some new slimes. That's the idea, anyways. I found a new food, an odd onion. That seems like something to plant. Excellent. They're so cute! What are these guys? <gasps> an angler slime! They're so cute! Aww. Whoa. Woo! Come on, do it again! I wanna fly! Let me fly! Come on, you so Yes! <laughs> Alright, I'm, I'm content. That's all I wanted. Look at all these seashells. <laughs> Can I get up there? I wanna go up there. Over on that side. Oh, it ate all of the chickens over here. That's a bummer. Ooh, there's a rocky slime! I want you, dude! We need a rock slime. Hell yeah! Might have to send out these chickens though, so I can continue to get more. Oh god, these guys are angry! What are they? They're angler pink largo? What are they? Oh my god, they're violent! Uh, have food! Be less violent! Get some seed hens. These seem like something to bring back and farm. Oh god. Oh god, they're terrifying! Oh god, they're terrifying! Where do I go? Where is go? Is this something that I'm supposed to be able- to Oh, I want to take this back too! Ah, oh, so many things. I'll have to come back for you. Look at this beautiful pod! It's so cute! Does this mean that I need to put them in a pond? I'm not sure. Maybe that's what that means. I see some more- are these baby- No, oh, they're just chickadees. Okay. More pots to destroy, that's fun. Surely there is a way to get up there. That looks like the right way to go up, yes. <laughs> I would like to touch the pond, but I fear for my life. Okay. Up here's pretty cool, though. Is that another fruit? Another food? Yeah, another food. I, I think I just need to go back home and, and dump off some stuff and come back, because boy howdy, I just have so many things that I vent. I vent them. 
I bent them so. Where is the exit for I must leave? What is that? Are you a lucky cat? Are you a lucky cat? Do you want a hen? Oh my, he left me money. Oh no, going back through this mess. Just ignore it, just ignore it, and everything will be fine. Everything will be hunky-dory. There's no need to be concerned! Everything's fine. Everything is A-OK. -okay. There is no need for concern. I'm just gonna parkour through here and pretend like nothing ever existed, and I'm just gonna go home. So you know what? Fuck you guys. Fuck you. I don't know if this is what I need or if I need a corral. Um, but they seem pretty happy in the little pond. They're very cute. Let's see if the rock slimes will... Nope, they're gonna escape, so... The rock slimes might need to go into another pen. Alright, I'll give you guys a pen. I know you like the little water, but I think they're gonna escape if I leave them in here. So, <laughs> we'll get another corral. Yeah, because look at you, you're already running away. We'll leave the pond here. I, I think I'll need it at some point, but... I'll just throw you guys in there. Why don't we go see what plorts we have to sell, and we'll do that and get some more... Try and get another hen house and another food storage plot. I think that's probably the way to go. So I got a couple of loose screws. I don't know if they work with the say hens. That I'm not too sure, but we'll figure it out. I really should have organized this better. It's kind of a hot mess, to be honest, but... Oh well. It's what I've decided. We'll move a pen later, I guess. I'll see if they breed with the sea hens. Otherwise, when I go back, I'm gonna have to look for a means of dealing with sea hen. I accidentally took two babies. Get it back in there, babies! Is the world of tar gone? I sure hope the world of tar is gone. Seems a little bit more peaceful this morning. <laughs> it's fine. For Look at all the bunnies. They're so cute. Oh no, that sounds like a tar showed up somewhere. That's not- that's not the noise you want to hear. That's not the noise you want to hear when you're just adventuring and don't see any problems. Ah, there he is. There- there's the problem, children. Hey, how about you- ow! How about you fuck off? I don't have a desire for this. I wish I came here with the sole desire to acquire. Nope. Fuck off, please. Thank you. I came here to acquire hen-based operatives, and you are in the way of my hen-based operatives. Okay. We're starting to make progress on where we're expanding to. Whee! Oh my. How am I supposed to get past these statues? Surely. Am I just supposed to ride this up as high as I can and then go forward? Is that the plan? I guess so. I guess that's how it do. No! Oh. Oh. I didn't pull it down. Yes, it's down. Huzzah. It's another strange diamond. Again, wish I had the space for it. I mean, I guess I could bring it them back over the rock plorts. Any plorts, really. <laughs> Since there's multiples, it seems like that's a resource I want to bring home. This seems more like the route that I'm supposed to take to go up to newer places. <gasps> Pond slimes. Well, I do have a pond. I'm sorry all this free money would be great, but, um, you guys need to come home with me. Oh, look at them! Look at them on the ground! Just look at him! Oh, you're so cute! I love how he sploots! You guys are good beans. You're coming home with me. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. You're coming home with me. I need these babies. What do we get? Another vac tank. Uh, extra tank. Excellent stuff. Oh, primordial oil. That's different than the mud that I've been getting. Okay. Well, I'll pull it over here, because surely we'll come back here later. I unfortunately don't have a portable refinery. 
I wonder if I need like a jetpack upgrade or something, because this feels like very much like a jumpy sort of situation. I see slimes over there. What is that? I want it! You're so cute! I want to take you home! You seem like something I should take home. Oh, I'm so conflicted. I want to bring everything back. Maybe I leave the radiant crystals here and I take you home. I don't know that I have room for everybody, but hey, I would like to try. Alright, I figured out how to use the gadget. It took me a little bit, but we teleported back home. Huzzah! Looks like we have lots of food potential. Oh, look! It is working! Good! Good. And they're gonna need some more good roostros over here, but it looks like it is making hens. Oh, look! You can go. You can come over this way, buddy. Aww. They're, bl they're so cute! Oh my god, they're so cute! I love them already! You guys are my favorite! I don't know if that's a good little thing, but they look so cute. They just look so happy. Hell yeah! Well, I'll just leave you the fruit in here then. If it would stop bouncing out of the cage, that would be great. It's been a while since I've been home. You guys need tended to. Can we upgrade this to have some uh, port collector? Absolutely. Food? Absolutely. And airnet is great just to avoid escapees, but... Let's see... I'm gonna fill you guys up with some... Oh, is that the port collector? Probably. Yep. Food things over here. I was pretty sure I brought six slimes. Did one of them, like, disappear? I'm confused. Ah, uh, the puddle slime. That's why they're all- they're shy, so I'll have to move these guys. Maybe I'll move the pond upstairs and move- um, I did want to move some other guys down here anyways. So what I might do is- also, I, there is an option maybe for me to make some more money and get some more, uh, stuff upstairs. Uh, by, uh, opening another area and we can move the pond over there. I do definitely need to restructure some things. I'm not gonna lie. It's a, it's a the things are a little bit messy, but I feel like we're making good progress. We got a couple of different slimes now. It's just a matter of me reorganizing, which I'll likely do off camera, so that you guys don't have to watch me struggle. <laughs> but uh, yeah, thank you guys for joining me on today's episode of Slime Rancher Two. If you liked it, please poke that like button and subscribe today for more derpy, awesome fun, and I will see you guys in the next video.